Hello guys, Upward here from my lab YouTube channel. Today we are going to compare the triplets. Let me break down the problem for you. We're gonna have two lists, one for Alice, one for Bob. We're gonna calculate like for index zero, which is bigger. If Alice has bigger integer than Bob, like in the first index, then Alice gets a point. If Bob is, has a bigger integer in the index, in the same index, like if, if the first item in Alice and Bob, which one of them has the bigger integer, he gets a point. That's the whole thing. So yeah, here's the uh, sample. Five, uh, uh, Alice points, which is five, six, seven, and Bob's point, which is three, six, and 10. Here, for the first one, Alice gets a point. Yeah, let's give Alice a point. For the second one, they are equal, so no one gets a point. And the third one, 7 and 10, Pops uh, has a bigger integer, then Pops gets a point, so 1-1. One, one. So, yeah, let's code it. Let me just change the language. Python 3, please. Give me that dark. equals one if oh yeah one if x bigger than let's say y or maybe let's say x is Alice and y is Bob and then else make it minus else minus one if y is bigger than x else make it zero for x and y in I don't know if it would work but let's see a and b I think we should have make a list No. Yes. You can run the command with Alt R. It didn't print anything. None type is not actual. What? Print. Let me just open the Python. Python console result it's one zero minus one so I think we get it but what's the problem here line 23 23 yeah because we didn't return anything anyway so yeah now if it let me explain this for you. If uh, x bigger than y, which is, where is x? Yes. x gonna equals Alice. y is gonna equals Bob. So if x is bigger than y here, then result list gonna add 1. Then in the second for loop, it's gonna check does x which is Alice is bigger than y no it's not bigger so it's gonna go for the next one else make it minus one if y is bigger than x which is Bob points if it is which is not it's gonna go to the third condition which is else zero so it's gonna equal zero then in the third for loop he's gonna check one if x is bigger than y, no, it's not. Else, minus 1, if y is bigger than x, which is actually true. As you can see here, it's he's given us this example. He's going to check 
fun. Okay, I hope you get the idea. So now what we're gonna do is just return. There is a cool function in Python in lists actually. You can count how many specific number in this list. So we're gonna say result dot count one and result dot count minus one and run the, this amazing app. Congratulations sirs so let's submit the code and see if we have a problem or not. Congratulations, thank you for watching guys and don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Peace out.